This playthrough is rated E10+. Greetings and salutations viewers, Valdemar back here. The mail is coming, and this time it's LEGO Marvel Avengers, published by Warner Brother Games. Is that not ironic in and of itself? That's right folks, a, a rival company produces a game based off of their rivals in the comic book uh, and movie genre. So, ah, uh, Marvel. Um, okay, so we guess do the basic stuff for starting up. Uh, I don't think I'll do any online stuff, sorry. I had to scratch you there for a second. Like that. This is ba okay. So Lego Marvel Avengers. This is based off the Marvels. I think this was made, and maybe with the. Uh, okay, I'm gonna skip that because I don't want to do any online stuff. Ooh, season past and a little content, web content. Yeah. Anyway, Lego's Marvels Avengers based off. Of, I think this content's based off the um, Age of Ultron, which is the second movie which came out. Was it last year? Or was it the year? I think it was the year before that because yeah I think that was 2014 anyway with the a remnant of Captain America Civil War coming out I thought why not play a Marvel game on on uh, or get a Marvel game through the mail and and why not Lego Lego's the best man so uh, it, for all uh, probably for people who don't know me too well I'm actually more of a if, if you know how when they say in, any, in a lot of worlds of genres they say uh, you know you have to be one or the other I tend to try and enjoy a lot of fandoms just together. But, you know, you have your Star Trek and Star Wars. You know, you have your football and basketball. You know, you have your, uh, you know, uh, just different, you know, you have your Lord of the Rings and, you know, the Chronicles of Narnia, stuff like that. Well, in this case, I'm more of a Marvels fan than a DC fan. But don't take it lightly that I just like, you know, I'm like, oh, pro Marvel all the way. DC is terrible. I'm like, no, no, I... I like DC stories too. They both have a rich history. They've been around for a really long time, and now with the movies being a big thing now, they've been, e become even more competitive than before. But that's not why we're here today. We're here to play with some fun old Legos, Legos you put together as a kid. Funny how back when I was a kid, it was uh, Legos was pretty big, and then for a short while there in the 90s, Lego was dropping off the planet. But then as soon as Lego, I think it was Lego Star Wars came out, all of a sudden Lego came back in the forefront. And now they're like. One of the biggest money makers in the toy industry currently. It's crazy. Report to your stations immediately. This is not a drill. We are under attack. <laughs> Loki Scepter must be here. Stroker couldn't mount his defense without it. Maria Hill to all Avengers. Advance to the fortress. We've confirmed Strucker is inside. Stop the Avengers! Okay. Looks like we're starting off with our good old bowman for hire, Hawkeye. The, uh, 
probably one of the weaker of the uh, of the adventures, just because you know he doesn't have any superpowers. He's just really, really good with a bow. You know what I mean? Uh, I like Hawkeye as a, as a character. He's supposed to be kind of a. I don't know. He's changed so much in the comics. Usually he's the serious character, but I don't know. In recent uh, recent stories, they've kind of made him a bit more. I won't say goofy, but like he's had a bit more of a. Oh, what's the word? Uh, a jokey attitude when it came to things. But uh, I don't know. Maybe they're. His character's always changed, really, over over the course of time. Anyway, oh, by the way, I forgot to say I was starting the game. And, two, this is multiplayer. If I had a friend, unfortunately, I don't, because I'm forever alone. Um, but uh, this also is based around, at least this part that I'm playing so far, is based off the Age of Ultron movie. So if you haven't played it before, I, I guess spoilers. Okay, so we need... Now can I just drop in, or would that kill me? That'll kill me. Okay, so we don't want to do that. So we need to, let's see, how do I switch? Okay, the R button. Now do I need to, okay, her ability is, I she can even pull out a gun and stuff like that. Oh, or her stun batons as well. Nope, we don't want to fall in. Okay, so, okay, I think I need to put something together, right? So I thought, maybe if I destroy them, I can, uh, Okay, so I thought um Oh is it why? Okay. Sorry, I haven't uh maybe I should have checked the instructions before I did this. How about we do that really quick? So I have no idea what I'm okay. I thought I thought B was build and use, but it's not doing anything. So why uh, why is change character, B is build, A is to roll and then Access to attack, but it's not letting me build anything. Okay, there we go. I was waiting for something to be built. I was like, that that's how you usually get through these games is by building stuff. I mean it's Legos. Oh, okay, so we need we need Black Widow for this part, so that's it. Oh, and she's wait. Did, X again. Oh, did I accidentally switch back to him? Oops, sorry. Okay, there we go. We have to press X multiple. Okay. There we go. Yay! I actually <laughs> got for, past the first puzzle. It's not really a puzzle. But, you know, it's supposed to be Legos. It's not supposed to be difficult. Okay, do I need to switch back to uh, Hawkeye? And, uh... I guess I should talk about the characters a bit. So, uh, I think... Is it Black Widow's name? Uh, Natasha Romanoff or whatever? Uh, former former Russian spy uh, of the Black Widow program who can uh, kill uh, any type of man with her or woman with her own hands. A very, a very deadly opponent. A spy for all ages. Right, so. Okay, so I need to do... Whoops. Oh, is that how I aim for stuff? Is by pressing... Okay, so so I do I need her to help build it? Oh, okay. So what am I doing exactly? Am I hacking it? I guess so. And then I'll try to help with this, but it isn't exactly an everyday scenario. Oh, okay. That's what I thought. Okay, so she was supposed to do something to hack it, and then he has to destroy it with his uh, arrows. Okay. So now, do we need to jump on it? Okay, good. Sorry, I I, I guess it it the there it. I guess I shouldn't be my. Uh, I guess I shouldn't be. Uh, whoops. Oh crap! I was trying to. Uh, I'm just gonna switch him. But I was trying to figure out what to do because I don't want to mock like the tutorial is just a, uh, I guess, you know, exploration. I, I shouldn't, it's the beginning of the game. We're just trying to figure out how to play, you know. I know these games are supposed to be made somewhat easy because, you know, um, I mean, kids are supposed to be able to play this. If I can't figure this out, it means I'm not as smart as a kid. Okay, so I need to, maybe I need to play as a, um, 
Okay. I was about to say, I thought we had to do something like, um... Uh, hack something so we can defeat these Hydra units. This takes place during when Hydra was, uh... Was big. Uh, it was one of those cases where if you watched uh, Agents of Shield or um, um, actually, it pretty much was Agents of Shield. Basically, if you watched Agents of Shield, it took place in between the movies. So if you missed bits of it, there would be certain functions or features of the movie you might have missed out on. You can still watch it as is, but um, you definitely learned a lot more if you uh, if you. Uh, um, I was just gonna grab everything before I before I finished up. Okay, so I need to use this. All right, what are we doing here? Oh, I need both of them on there. Hey, now are you attacking me? How dare you? Anyway, let's back up. Okay, and then I need her on there too, because we're gonna teleport, right? Oh, okay, it's a combo ability. Gotcha. Think we lost element of surprise. Is that from the voice actors? Thank you. Yeah, very poor lot read on your part, uh um whoever voicing is I don't think the actual actors from the show or, or movies are voicing these guys. I don't think so. But anyway, we have to play as Hulk. I guess Hulk and uh, Hulk Smash. And uh, we're also playing Tony Stark, a.k.a. Iron Man. So. Oh, and I guess... Uh... <laughs> well, if it isn't that dude... If it isn't... Um... Okay. Well, I can... Iron Man can destroy gold Lego objects by using heat-based... Beams hold B, and other characters like Hawkeye can target tar can fire thermo arrows. Hold X to target. Okay, so I need to when it comes to certain areas, I need to switch to uh, uh, Iron Man. Just like other games, uh, basically, uh, or other Lego games, each character has like their own special abilities. Like if you're playing like Harry Potter and so forth and so on. Um, if it isn't, if it isn't the actual guys from the movie, then. Uh, uh, like Robert Downey Jr. stuff like that, then the guys are pretty, doing a pretty decent job of uh, sounding close to it. Okay, maybe I have to, I have to be on the bridge to do that. There we go. Super heat. By the way, my favorite of uh, my favorite uh, Marvel superhero, at least in terms of the not over of all times, but in terms of the movie universe characters, would probably have to be Iron Man. And Iron Man really started, jump-started the, uh... So we need to destroy the power shield. Anyway, uh, we need to... Uh, anyway, Mar uh, like, there have been Spider-Man stuff like that, but Spider-Man had been done by Sony, but Iron Man was the first, uh, uh, movie done by the Marvel Studio when I think... I think they had just been bought by Disney, or they were about to be bought by Disney, but it was, like, one of the first movies done by the Marvel... Uh, face of the Marvel movie, just like juggernaut, and that, and because of how well it did, it uh, okay, I guess you can have a a special. Okay, so we need to just destroy this thing, otherwise they're just gonna keep uh, uh otherwise they're gonna keep spawning. Right? Okay, so I think I need to get. I assume Iron Man needs to be up there. Yeah, might as well destroy everything before we. Uh, can I destroy this? Uh... It doesn't look like it. Okay. So let's switch to Tony or Iron Man, however you want to. Looks like he's got a floating option. Okay, so we need to. Actually, can I? I thought so. Okay, so. Can I heat it up because it's gold? Oh, I need Thor for that, but he's not here. At least according Need to this some anyway. assistance? Sure. I can Characters talk to you with this. electrical powers can charge up. Yeah. Oh, I need to highlight the panel. Gotcha. Okay. Maybe? No? Huh. Okay. Wow. I must be, like, stupid. <laughs> oh, that's, uh, okay. Is that. Can Hulk do something with that? 
Oh, okay. I need, I need to press, keep pressing B. So I can only. So if I replay the level as, as a. Um, okay. So if I replay the level, because I know you can replay levels as certain characters. So if I replay the level with Thor, I can do something with this. Gotcha. Okay. I'm trying to do everything at once in a level, but I I got to remember that that's not the case. You can re go back and unlock certain things with other characters. Okay, let's charge this up with Tony. I did it right. Oh, I guess I just had to pull. Oh, okay. I have to. Go. Okay, gotcha. Man, have I not played like a thinking game in forever or something? Is that why I'm not a? Uh... Okay, so do I need to switch back to Hulk then or? No. Maybe I need to keep keep doing something with Tony. Okay, I just wasn't. Uh, gotcha. Okay. Oh, there we go. Okay. Yay! I can. I can. I have. I have a. We must protect the fortress. I, What's the word? I have thinking. I can think. I can think, young comrade. I use brain. I'm oh, sorry. I shouldn't be. If I'm, 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 if I'm trying to use the voice of being dumb, I shouldn't use like a, a foreign accent because that's not how that works. All right, now we switch to the, the incomparable team of Captain America, Steve Rogers, and Thor. I forgot what it is. Remember back in the day when Thor used to be like cursed on Earth as a man, and every time he wanted to activate his powers, he had to like use like a wooden stick and call upon the powers of Thor or something like that, because he had been cursed to live on on planet Earth or something like that. But okay, so how do you how do you rate? Okay, so you press A to can I? Alright, looks like you have finishing moves too. Okay, so doing that will raise. B will lower me. Can't seem to like finish them off. But it looks like we've also got uh, finishing moves as well, so we can beat it up and then uh, just uh, insta finish them off. Well, I guess if the game lets me do it. I guess I've been knocking out a couple times for here. Steve Rogers, Captain America. Basically, his superpower is that his body is basically maxed out in terms of the human condition, which means he's a. Uh, uh, he's basically, if I remember correctly, his uh, stats are basically he's an Olymp. He's human maximized, like the, the human potential at its max, which means max. So he's like an Olympic athlete, like in terms of his uh, uh, strength. So how do I get these guys to, uh, can I throw, ah, okay, gotcha, I throw a shield at him. Ha ho, and he ricochets off something to, oops, I got killed. Because <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Alright, so Captain America's ability is being able to throw a shield. And I assume he uses some, oh, nice. Boom, baby. Right through the ice wall. Alright, so is there anything we can also get? Before we head on. Yeah, don't worry, folks. I'll eventually get used to figuring out puzzles and stuff like that. I'm not a complete moron. I'm only one fourth. I'm only one fourth retarded. You know. And no, not in special ed person. By that I mean the word. Ah, forget it. It's an E10 plus game. I can't. I can't really be going into that type of semantics. So sorry, folks. I apologize. Okay, so now we need to get past here. Now do I need to... Ah! Frick. Alright. So I guess I assume I need to uh, switch to... Oh, I didn't know I could just raise my shield up. Okay, anyway. I assume I need to do something with Thor, maybe? Yeah, that's right. That's right, buddy. Because I can fly, it's not... Okay, so... Let's get some more... Let's get some more goodies. To me, there's not much uh, background noise going on right there. Either that or I've got it turned down pretty low or something. But, uh, okay. now, I don't have to destroy all this stuff. I'm just doing it because... Oh, ah! 
God of Thunder doesn't like burning. Apparently. Is there anything to build here? Oh, that's his. Oh, I can charge up my hammer for with lightning. Okay. Can I do anything to that? Can I use my hammer to bust it? Oh, okay. No, that's just. Doesn't look like it. Let's switch to Cap. Let's see if he's got anything. And I can't build anything, right? There's no building option. Okay. Let's keep going and then maybe we'll figure something out. What? Oh, okay. So I have to put out the fires. Already, are we? Gotcha, okay. Well, I just have to figure it out, game. Give me give me a moment. You know, cl critical thinking is not... is When you hit a certain age, critical thinking is not on your to-do list of things to, to, to use on a regular basis. Alright, we do the one thing that Lego is good at. Building things! Alright! Okay, so we got an in machine there. Oh, whoops, wrong button. Oh, nice. There's a little drill to get through all that. Okay, so now I need to sit back to four, because Ryan and need to bust down the wall. Yeah. I assume if I replay the level, I can I can unlock some of those other areas in it. But... Fire the turret! Destroy them! Those turrets aren't going to let up. Better use the trench to get through. All right, Maria Hill, uh, second in command of... Uh, of uh, the S.H.I.E.L.D. agency. Can Thor and Captain America get through the trench and get to Hydra? What, will the Avengers be able to finish off Hydra and finally save the world from their tyranny? Find out next time on LEGO Marvel Avengers. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Excelsior!